Hi. Progress has been slow on the e-bike, so I thought I would go through some of the parts I have. First off is the Subvaton SVMC72150. So I ordered the controller from AliExpress.com and you can see from the specs that it has a DC current limit of 150 amps, a max phase current of 350 amps and a battery voltage recommended between 24 to 72 volts. The controller comes with a bag containing connectors to join up your wiring to all the ancillaries. You can see in the bag there are connectors and pins to do your own wiring. In another bag is a USB wire and a Bluetooth adapter. You can see the screw terminals for the positive and negative wires and the three phase wires. The mirrors are another purchase from AliExpress and are pretty good quality for the price. They are purchased separately and cost £10.40 each. I bought this twist grip throttle first but it was a pile of junk. The twist action was nasty and the overall quality was rubbish. So after getting over my initial shock of buying such a terrible grip throttle, I purchased another better quality twist grip throttle and the quality was so much better. It's a Pajon e-bike twist throttle and it's 24 to 72 volts and the action feels great. I will have to get back to you on how it performs when in use. I bought this rear wheel from AliExpress and is rated at 3000 watts but will probably take a lot more in short bursts. I have mocked up the wheel on the swing arm for test fitment and I'm using a 203mm disc with a 7 speed free wheel and a single speed tensioner. On the front is a 19 inch motorcycle rim with a 203mm disc. Another purchase from AliExpress is these XOD hydraulic brakes with built in switches. Everything I've test fitted so far has gone on with only a few problems. Now the winter is over I will be stripping the bike back down and building it back up now I know everything fits okay. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.